Hey yo, since you clicked on this video, you are officially a glizzy gobbler. To undo this, drop a like right now. If not, enjoy gobbling them glizzies. No cap. I keep that lid on me like I got a test. Five a cigarette, I need one when I'm straight. Looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more? Visit sportstmb.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Charles. Okay, I'm back to another video, man. If you're to the channel, man, to subscribe, you turn subscribe, on to a like, comment down below. Your boy, man, how he doing? And turn on those fucking tapes so you never miss an upload from me, your boy. Also, in the comments down below is our VC giveaway. You want to wait once we hit 90k? So go in the comments down below. Get your chance to win some free VC. But today, today, man, I got this VC glitch for y'all, and this VC glitch is gonna be across the board. Anybody's gonna be able to do this. Every console gonna be able to do this. You don't need nothing but two. 2K21 and me and you know what I'm saying your controller whatever you use to play to play now uh, it's pretty simple to do to start this you want to head over to my league and once you guys get to my league you want to simply hit triangle on this and go to new league then you want to go to current NBA team start in regular season then you want to hit start mode now from here you want to select two teams all right so I'm gonna select the Cavs and then I'm gonna go select the Lakers all right now once you select the your two teams simply want to hit start then once you get here to this menu, you want to hit start once again. And once this message pops up about the rookie, you just want to simply hit auto generate rookies, okay? Now, once that has gone away, simply hit circle. Then you want to continue to hit R1 until you get to the option screen. Then you want to select my league settings. Now, from here, you want to select simulate accordingly and a regular accordingly. If you want to put both of those on five minutes, all right? As you guys can see, just like that. Then you want to head into your real center. And once you guys get here, make sure your quarter limit is on five minutes as well. And you want to turn your game speed all the way to 100. And you want to turn your fouling out off as well. Once you guys have those settings, simply uh, hit circle. Then you want to go into your coaching settings. Now, everything timeout, you want to put on manual. Player minutes, you want to put it on manual as well. And substitution, you want to put it on manual as well. Now, once you guys have these settings, you're, you know what I'm saying, you're good in this tab. You want to head over to the CPU and user sliders. Now, from here, once you guys get here, you want to simply click R2 to put user in. And then you want to just go to the close shot, the inside shot, your mid-range shot, and your three-point shot. Now, basically, what you're basically going to do is just put all of those up as you see me doing. Now, once you're done doing that, scroll all the way down till you get right here to the foul. Now, all the fouls, you're just going to simply scroll them down and put them all on zero, okay? Okay, now once you guys get done putting everything on zero, it should look exactly like this. Now once that is finished, simply back out of this and head back to the calendar screen. Now once you guys get here, simply want to select the first game of the season and hit play game. Now once this message, if this message pops up, just hit auto, uh, handle those roster changes or whatever. Now once you guys get to the screen right here, simply put yourself in the middle, hit X and start this game up. Okay, now as you guys can see, once you get into the game, you will be up in the little Raptors type camera, and that's what you want. Now, basically, what you're gonna do is let this game play out. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be 100% worth it. Just let this game play out. You don't have to do nothing. You can go chill, watch a few videos. You know what I'm saying? Watch, watch a little bit of Netflix, and just come back. The quarter lengths are on five minutes, so it's not gonna be long at all. So yeah, I'll be right back. Let me just fast forward real quick. You know, this don't take no time. I'll be right back.
Okay, now as you guys can see, this game is officially over, all right? Now once this game is over, you'll be brought to this screen right here. And once you guys get here, you just want to go up to quit and quit the game. And once you guys have quit the game, you want to pay attention to the bottom left-hand corner. It will tell you how much VC you got. So I got 475, right? Okay. Now what you guys want to do is simply tap R, R3 to the right, the R of the right stick. You want to tap it to the right. You guys can see it switches the team that you want. Okay. So you want to go to your second team. Now once you guys get to your second team, you want to go back to your options now. You want to go to your settings. Then you want to change this to 12 minutes. Okay. And once you have changed it to 12 minutes, simply go back to the calendar. Then you want to play another game. Now this time you want to simulate with SimCast Live. And once you have selected that, it will begin to load up. Now, okay, as you guys can see, once you load up into this game, you'll be putting this right here. Now, what you guys wanna do at the bottom right is flick your right stick three or four times to change it to the six times speed, and then it will begin to play this game for you. And don't worry, you will win because of the sliders we have implemented and uh, stuff like that. So the computer can't really score, it's just your team. Now, basically what you're gonna do, you're gonna wait for this once again, and I'll be right back to show you guys the results from this. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, now as you guys can see, once that game is over, you simply just want to hit quit like we did with the first one. And in the bottom corner, as you guys can see, we got 300 VC. Now look, let me just tell you this before anybody even start uh, commenting or, or writing whatever. Now basically, the more you, you know what I'm saying, you wait on the first game is, is the more you will get. So let's say we play on what, five minutes? So we got like 475. So if you play on something higher than that, like six or seven minutes, you're going to get to six to 700 VC from that. And plus this, that's 1,000 VC every time. Now, let me just say this, it does take a little minute. I would say it takes like 10 minutes per game. It's, it's really not that long, if you ask me. That, to me, that's better than playing career. I personally don't like playing career, but yeah. There you guys go. You can do this good as the one I posted it. Don't forget to like the video. I'm into that giveaway. It's your boy Charles 2K. I'm out.